it feels like I have to explain myself. Explain myself for other people's actions. As you can see here, do a dox the truth seeker. Do you want me to tell you what, Dave? Entirely up to you, whatever you do. I'm not scared, I'm not bothered. I was coming out Wednesday anyway, so if Matty done a do a live, then that's your prerogative, do what you gotta do. But I will not be classed as a liar. I will not be classed as a person who tells lies. Because to me, you said that I doxed you. Is there any factual proof? Is there any factual evidence that I have? Everything I put out regarding an address is public knowledge. Public knowledge because you run a business. I put the address of the business that you are running. Public knowledge. Get me wrong. No home address. It's a public knowledge that you are running a uh, private investigation business with an address. So I put it up. To me, are you living in a unit? That's the only address I have ever put up. Or am I wrong? I only put out the truth. Facts. You are running a private investigation business from a unit and I put that address out so if you're living in a unit then I apologise but it's a unit not a house I haven't doxed anybody's address home address I wouldn't do you know what I'm like about people turning up at people's houses where there's kids and families and other people I've fucking disputed that loads of times. It's wrong. So don't try and make out that I did something when I didn't. If I did, put it out. Don't make out that I'm a liar. And it's a bit strange how you deleted mine and Venom's comments off this post. I don't understand why, because you're trying to make everything one-sided. Venom said, I haven't seen that. And I put, and there was more comments, but you deleted and I put, dox the cunt. You've got, even got rid of that. Why? Why are you making everything one-sided? Like I said, you don't know me. Whatever you do know, you wouldn't do what you think you would do. Because I'll show you. I'll put a little bit out about what I'm about and what I do and what I did. See if you can find me in the video. I'll give you a little... You're a detective, aren't you? Private detective. See if you you know which one I am in these videos, what I'm going to put out. See if you can see me, because I'm there. All I've got to say to you, don't make out that i done something when I am it. At the end of the day, everything I've done, I admit to. But don't make me out look a liar. Bang out her order. Just because you are. It's all about what your narrative's all about, Dave. Fuck other people, but I will not be classed as a liar. That's all you're trying to do. You're trying to, to tarnish my name because you can see loads of people are coming to my channel. You're trying to make me look a cunt. No cunts here, mate. I went through that when I was younger. That's why I turned out where I was dead. But I'll put you a little bit out. See if you can put it all together, eh? La. I met a lad, yeah, who introduced me 
to football, I was a Stoke City fan, yeah? Um, and then through football, to be tasted with the fist, yeah? I'll, I met this family, you know? And these have been my friends for 15, I'm 30 years old this year. He's been my best friends ever. He's been like a dad to me, more than my own dad has. Yeah? I've been Jasper at 4 o'clock in the morning. Jasper had fun. I'm so glad that I know these people. You know, mate, the best people in the world. I'm a lucky man, a lucky man. We get at least a hundred young lads a year. A hundred. Come to our doors. Want to be part of the culture. We watch them. We look at them. Scrutinise them. Out of that hundred, only ten will stay for life. Ten will stay for life. The others don't make the grade. So, it, it, you know, it, 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 it's not like you just walk in, put the gear on. I'm a football loser. It's, it's tough. Mm -hmm. so, we are a very, very, very violent fucking fan. When you see a lad who's got that specific amount of violence in him, who's cuckoo, who's a nice lad, you grab him and hold him and nurture him and love him and bring him through the ranks. The proper way. Not like going to pub, smash a pub up, no respect. Fuck that, bring him right, because they are our next generation. You really respect when we When we have finished doing what we're doing, they are coming through the next rank. And you've got to bring them up right, the reputation of Stoke City. John, I do. As you can see, this is the proof. This is the only thing I put up. Public knowledge. When you open a business, it's public knowledge. This is all I put up, this address. See how it says, Unit 25. It's a unit, not a house address. I don't know why I have to explain myself to this kind of people. But when they try to make me out look a fucking liar, try and make out that it's all about one thing, one narrative, wrong. Like I said, don't go in on people and try and make them look a cunt when you don't know the fucking facts. These are the facts. If I have, then prove it. But we all know it's not going to happen, don't we? At the end of the day, it's public knowledge. I shouldn't have to do this, but there you go. Facts, people, that's what it's 